it's Joanne. I wanted to put this video up because many of us have many, many talents. I know that I have natural gifts or talents and I'm very thankful for those, but I can honestly say that decorating with accessories is not one of my talents. I fall short. I can paint a room, I can pick colors, I can do window treatments, but when it comes down to the accessories and the decorating, whether it be just a bookshelf for a living room or a, a study, or whether it comes to party decorating or uh, holiday decorating, I don't have those natural talents like some people that I follow on YouTube. And one of those people is, I think her name is Liz, although to me she looks like a Kim, so I always want to call her Kim. Liz at Savvy Seasons and I just started watching her YouTube channel and she gave some wonderful tips for decorating for the holidays and I literally copied her. I went and found some identical things that she found so I'm going to make this video a video reply or response to her video. So I'm going to start with the dollar store Christmas uh, well I'll just show you. I don't even know which column. They're packages on a candle holder and um, here's what mine look like. Isn't this cute? Let's see if I can show you the whole thing back here. It's basically three styrofoam boxes or squares that you cover with wire ribbon and you put a, a ribbon on the top with some coiled ribbon. I actually already had the um, the coiling ribbon at my house, so I just picked up this from the dollar store. I picked up three styrofoam blocks and I had these candle holders. I actually have two of them and they're, they're two different sizes. One's taller than the other. I picked these up at Goodwill last year, so. <laughs> How do you like that for a video thumbnail? <laughs> okay, anyway, um, <laughs> maybe I'll use that actually. Um, so I had these from Goodwill, six cubes, um, I think I actually had to go back, I know I had to go back for more of the ribbon because I was wrapping them more than I needed to. I was wondering why she wrapped them in her video only on three sides and then it was like, well duh, that's all you need to do because one side is obviously on the bottom. So they're completely wrapped but my thumbtacks are on the bottom. And to figure out how to make these, I will put a link to her video in mine so you can see that. So these were my dollar store finds, which I'm thrilled because I needed something high on one side of the mantle. I had three of those um, red colored sparkly cones in different heights and I need something to balance it on the other side. Then there are these ornaments that I got also from the dollar store. So. They, I'm sorry, I'm saying dollar store, but I meant dollar tree specifically, so everything in the store is a dollar. These ornaments, whoops, this one's coming unglued. <laughs> I just hot glued them. So this was also Liz's idea. Dollar store ornaments, and that one's coming unglued. I oh, guess I didn't hot glue them enough. Dollar store ornaments upside down in dollar tree candlestick holders put on a candle. These are the silver ones. I couldn't find any of the one, other ones that she used, but I did find these ornaments. They're red and green, and I put them next to a poinsettia, so they're really pretty. And same idea, just hot glue them upside down into the candle holders. And what I like about this is I can use these candle holders for another holiday. Simply take out the Christmas one, by tugging it with the hot glue obviously is not affixed permanently as you can see and then I have these beautiful table decorations for the cheap for cheap yeah so anyway um, that was my video response to Liz and I want to thank her because she really truly is a gifted decorator if you watch her videos which I spent Oh gosh, you know, my coffee time in the morning, I like to watch other people's YouTube videos, and she is one that I just kind of went through her whole entire history and watched every single one of her videos and uh, was really inspired because she is truly talented. So thank you to Liz, 
And thank you guys for watching. I hope you like this video, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye!